Hi guys, welcome to ASA Technical. In this video, I will show you how to fix your version of Windows 11 has reached the end of service. Click to download a new version of Windows 11 to stay supported. If you encounter the message your version of Windows has reached end of service, it understandable to feel frustrated. This notification appears when Microsoft stops supporting your current Windows version potentially leading to security vulnerabilities and performance issues due to lack of updates. However, there's no need to worry. There are several solutions to resolve this issue and keep your system up to date and functioning properly. This message is more than just a warning about an outdated operating system. It also indicates that certain versions no longer meet the necessary security standards to protect your device. If you have received this notification, keep watching as we walk you through the steps to fix this problem and ensure your windows remains secure and up to date. So let's get started. First, let's start by checking if your computer meets the necessary requirements for windows upgrade. Just follow these steps to verify. To check processor, RAM, storage, you will need to download PC Health Check Utility from Microsoft's official website. After downloading and install, simply double click on it to run this utility and click on check now button. If your device does not meet the requirement specifications like DPM 2.2, processor, secure boot and storage, as you can see in my case the processor is showing as unsupported. If you encounter any such problems, in that case, upgrading your hardware may be challenging, but it is possible to fix this problem by upgrading the OS. However, don't worry, if your system meets or does not meet the criteria, then this video will definitely help to fix this problem. To fix the issue, you will need a Windows 11 bootable USB drive supporting legacy and UEFI both. If you don't know how to create this dual boot supported USB drive, then here's a detailed tutorial on how to create Windows 11 bootable USB drive supporting UEFI and legacy BIOS. Once you have made it, now you are all set. Now insert the Windows installation media into your computer's USB port and go to the file explorer and open the bootable USB drive. Now double click on setup.exe file. Once you run setup.exe, follow these steps to complete the upgrade. The Windows setup screen will appear. Now click on change how setup download updates. Select recommended option and click next and wait for the setup to check for updates. If your PC is unsupported, you may see a this PC does not meet Windows 11 requirements message. In that case, just close the setup screen and eject the bootable USB drive and disconnect the internet connection and reinsert your bootable USB drive. After inserting, again run the setup.exe file. Now this time select not right now. After doing this, no more errors will appear. Now accept the license terms. And click on choose what to keep. Select Keep Personal Files and Apps if upgrading from Windows 10 and 11. If this option is grayed out, restart the setup and try again and please do not select any other options. And click Next. Now click on Install to proceed. Now setup will start copying the files and preparing the installation. Please keep patience. Your PC may restart multiple times 
This is normal. And please note, do not turn off this PC during this update. After installation, your PC will boot into Windows 11. Now go to settings, then Windows update and install any missing updates. If drivers are missing, install them from your manufacturer website. So I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.